what we what we say about Ezra? Uh, you were saying yeah. he could be he the he most be like. Uh, he the most. Oh, uh, what do we? Oh, he, hey man, he uh, got the most jewels. They gave him the most. It was. I wish I could remember the line. Nobody. He got the nobody, most jewels, man. He got more no, jewels than any. Four nobody shooters. got more jewels, and we can make this a little separate segment. Nobody got more jewels than than um the Ezra Ezra Bridger man. No, Ezra Bridger is the most enlightened Jedi to ever exist. I'm talking about. Uh, no, enlightened Padawan. That there ever was, yeah. He talked to everybody. He got a everybody. little bit of. He got some of Darth Maul. He got some Sith work. He got. Some he got Sith. some Emperor work. He got some. Emperor he got some work. Darth Vader work. He got some Ahsoka Tano work. He got some Obi Wan work. He Obi work. Yo, man, he nobody got more jewels than this Padawan. He got Ezra Kanan. Bridget. He started with Kanan. Kanan. Yeah, Kanan. He got, he got Kanan. He got the Bendu. He got the Bendu. He, he got, got the Bendu. <laughs> <laughs> got the Bendu. Got the damn Bendu. Oh, he got the Bendu. And he can talk was, to animals, bro. And he could talk his force. His force, his force levels was that. And then he got military work. Right, so he, he got, got with like yeah, he got strategic. Even, he got military work. He could fly. Make he, he got the most. He got Mandalorian work. <laughs> he, no, look, he should be the greatest of us all. Remember when Pip Palpatine <laughs> said that? Like, the Vader's gonna be the greatest of like he wasn't looking. <laughs> Ezra should nah. have been the greatest of us all because hey. he got the, he he could look in the holocaust. <laughs> yes. When Palpatine told Yoda, he talked to Yoda. Vader, Vader gonna be more powerful than both of us. He was talking about Ezra. <laughs> <laughs> Ezra, bro. No, Ezra. Hey, Ezra when when Yoda said, travel. "No," <laughs> talking about Ezra, man. Faith in, faith in your Padawan. You dude, like too early. Your time has been whatever his little line was. Like, nah, I'm not talking. I'm talking about Ezra. Ezra was that guy, bro. He got more. Ezra jewels. was the one, man. He could, he can, he can lift Jedi temples. He had, he was, Luke, Luke man, Luke ended up going to Jedi temples. I was about to sun him to make my point, <laughs> but I ain't gonna he do did. that. To he God. did, but he had Jedi temples. Man, he was doing the most, man. He was doing the most. Like you said, he got Sith knowledge. He got Jedi knowledge. He got the great. He he was he was messing with Yoda, bro. He talked to Yoda. Bro, he talking he, to Yoda. We're talking to Force Yoda. Like Yoda was in Dago Bar. Like, let me go ahead and talk to this little nigga. <laughs> this little nigga nice. <laughs> talking to my little man's real quick. You no, know, I, I sense this nigga, man. I, 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 can see. I sense the little. He talking to Qui Gon Ghost and shit. <laughs> you know I mean, I sense the little nigga. I mean, I, hey, look, man. little nigga kind of, you know, he kind of lost. Though, you know, and nigga, look, he's, he's like, he's like, he's like, I mean, a nigga everywhere, man. I mean, a nigga want to be a Mandalorian. The nigga, I don't, you know, listen. You know, he got the hands and shit. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> I mean, nigga everywhere. You know what I mean? Let me, let me, let me holler at him real quick. Hand thing, Yoda. Uh, hey, man. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he got all that. But he, he got, got all, all that. that, man. Nobody got more. Kanan didn't get that. Kanan was getting man. enlightened, messing with Ezra. Like stuff that he got, messing with Ezra. I don't think Ahsoka would have found them if Ezra wasn't on that ship. That's why she was willing at the end to go like, yeah, I didn't go find this little nigga. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> Bro, he the key to the rest of the she cause she didn't know about Luke. She didn't know, she didn't know that there she didn't know about Luke, right? So it's like she, know about Luke. she bro, that was like her life mission was to find she, Ezra. Hey man, Ezra is the key to the Mandoverse B. <laughs> He literally is. Like I said, I called him. He I called him a Nexus B. Yeah, I, I had to pull a name from another another IP. I had to pull a name from another IP. He's a ne yo. No, no, he the no. Key to the, he key to no. the key to this man. Hey, hey, big homie, big homie, for real. <laughs> big homie. Now you you called it. Not only is he the key to the Mando verse. He the key to the Star Wars universe franchise. Everything the the IP. Ezra is the Damn. one. If you if you gonna reset you gave, everything, you just gave me you just gave me chills, bro. Because you ain't if, never lied. If you if you all jokes reset, aside, 
if you're going to reset everything, it's going to come through Ezra. You can't do it without him. The, the uh, without world him. between worlds and all that. He's the one, bro. He can change. He's seen things. He saw, he pulled uh, Ahsoka out. Bro, you don't think he can pull Luke out of, hey, I'm going to kill your nephew? What do you Now again, that's a pipe dream. Pause. That's a pipe dream. Pause. But they they talking about they want to. Hey, they be, they be talking that. Hey, we want to reboot, and that's probably never gonna happen. Whatever. But what I'm saying is, you're right, man. You called it. He the key to the Mandoverse. But he's the future of the Mandoverse. Though, but you ain't lying about the Star Wars thing though, because it's like, because oh, like for real, it's Rebels, right? He was strong with the Force at the end of Rebels. Like he was strong with the force, right? To the like you say, to the point where he had the pergil coming from miles and, and he all this, and then he knew what he he knew what he was gonna do before it happened. He knew that was gonna happen. He was strong with the force that especially at the Canaan dot. It's like he took his he took his life essence, right? He had to look, it's three levels of the force, right? We getting we getting deep. Yeah, we about the nerd, right. we about the we about the fan. You got the here. you got the you got some kind of different versions of the force, right? It's probably more versions of the force, but just put it like this: you got the you got the you got the uh, the life force, right? That Qui Gon was about. Mm-hmm. You had the you had the uh, uh, I don't want to call it dark side. I don't want to get into that. There's another one too, but then there was the cosmic force. Ezra was that's was Ezra's thing, man. The cosmic force. That's what I'm saying. I don't think Ezra is gonna be like. Ezra's not going to be this super powerful warrior that Luke is right now. Like, Luke is the most yeah. powerful Jedi. Great. Luke a grandmaster already right now. He, he he got the bloodline. He the most powerful being. He the most powerful Jedi right now, right? Like, sword work. Just off oh, pure talent. Yeah, like, pure yeah, talent. Yeah. He just, he, he killing yeah. everybody. He, he, he wreck everybody, including uh, Ahsoka, right? Ezra's Ezra's almost. I think Ezra's gonna end up being like a force of nature, more like you know, more of yeah, like yeah, said, yeah, more, a part of the cosmic force, like you said, yeah, to the point where it's like it ain't gonna be about his sword, his 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 lightsaber work. It, it ain't gonna be about his use of the force. It's gonna be more so like man, and I think Lucas gonna see him and be like, man, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta link up with you just off the, off the, off of the. Strength of uh, of uh, the force continuing on the, the way it's yeah. supposed to. I gotta save you just off that. I don't off really that. because you ain't gonna, you can't be my student. I ain't really. We can learn stuff from each other, but this is more about. I need to. I need to get you back here. Yeah, for the betterment be of the force. Yoda, Yoda, Mace, Windu, like we like colleagues. I'm, I mean, I'm still. I'm yeah. him. I'm yeah, him. Yeah, because <laughs> Ezra don't have the. He, yeah, I'm him, nah. but Ezra don't have the hand work. He don't have the work. Like they, nah. he don't have that. He never had that. He never got the chance to get that. Right? Nah. Um. He would have nah. to still. He would have to like train a little bit more in terms of not not from the force. He gonna be nasty with the force, right? But in terms of like you pull them sabers out, we got to go do do some things. Like like Ezra is not. He's not even close. He's not close to Ahsoka right now in that. But the Ezra. force. He in another space, bro. He in another plate. Like he in another stratosphere with that shit. Like you said, the cosmic force. Uh, you could talk to animals, but the animals you talk to are you talking to Pergil, my guy? You talking to animals that that's that that and you know a hyperdrive work. Remember, and this is getting to the science fiction-y part of Star Wars, right? Remember. So you you know how in, in 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 most science fiction and I think including Star Wars hyperdrive work. There's a bubble protecting whatever you're traveling in, whatever ship you travel mm-hmm. in. That keeps you from aging out, right? But otherwise, yeah. you going light years across the galaxy, you'll be you'll be a skeleton. Yeah, yeah. If you weren't protected, you'll be dust by the time you get to where you're going. <laughs> Pergil, they not you know they just naturally got that. So it's like, bro, if you. You could talk to beings that got that type of power, that 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 are that, uh, that are connected in the force that way. It's, it's what I mean. It, it seems like it just. I'm just. It just seems like Ezra has a lot to do with time travel, like time. Yeah, that, yeah. 
yeah, like time travel elements. Like it just seems like he's not gonna be somebody who's going to play by the same rules as a Luke and, and Ahsoka when it comes to time. We know what we're looking at. Like we, hey man, it's five years after the war ended. We don't know where Ezra really is. Like Ezra might come out of the thing, man, and think that he just left yesterday. Wait a minute, what y'all mean? We won the war. Oh, the war over? Damn, when I, I left, the war was just starting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What do you mean? Dog on the go. He might be a kid. He, yeah, he might still be a kid. Like we don't know. But or he might come back and be a grown ass man. He might be like, I was in that thing for, for hey, it was five years for y'all, or it was ten years for y'all for me. 20 years, whatever. We don't know. We don't know. But it just seems like he's or not like gonna a play level by level of experience from different things. Yeah, he might be right. a, he might be a grandmaster when he come out. We don't know, but it just seems like he's not gonna play by the same rules when it comes to time. And it just it it is it, you gotta start asking yourself, and this is going back to why I say that to make to further my point on him being the future of the entire IP. Bro, where's Ezra in the in the sequel trilogy? Where do we fit in in that? Yeah, where, is he, where does he fit in? Like, you can't just tell me he died or he or he died in the temple attack with the rest of the Jedi Luke had. Nah, bro, y'all can't kill off Ezra like that. So you either telling and me, my gotta, bad, my you, bad, go ahead. No, nah, I'm just saying, just to finish, you got to explain to me what happened. That's what I mean. Like, some I think something got to give with that man, and, and we might we might see branching paths. That's you know, and and guess. when you look, when you look at it, like like two things. Ezra's younger than Luke, maybe like some year, like a year or two, like Very not much. not like a substantial. They either the same age or he like a year or two younger than Luke, right? Depending on what, what they try to tell you, like when they try to yeah. tell you, like you know, they kind of reverse it, like how old was because Luke and Luke and Leia are twins. I forget how old they say Leia was in the new one. Was she sixteen or was she eighteen or nineteen? I can't remember. But Han, but Han was on her, so we gonna have to say she was at least nineteen. Right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Han was on her, so we gonna give her nineteen. But I think, but like he 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 blipped out at the beginning of New Hope, right? Lethal got freed. And then they blew up the Death Star. Like it's the same time, right? Like wow. if you watch the movie, you watch the end of the season. The last season, uh, Thrawn was trying to get his um his project. His project was uh the ships, right? He had the he had the uh top fighters that were like enhanced, but Krennic had Stardust. Right? Mm. <laughs> so since since you just lost the gas when Kanan died, well we don't have no fuel. We can't move your thing. We are gonna go forward with um Krennic's idea, Stardust. A little bit after that, you know the Death Star gonna blow up. It's at the same time. It's congruent. It's the same time. I say all that to say he was like sixteen. Dang. He was like sixteen. So he had a couple years. I'm just saying he either the same age or younger. So like it, like where like other people like like Mando's Mando gonna age out by the time the sequel trilogy come. Just in age, yeah. he don't have to get killed off. He just gonna nah. die because he was old, right? It's natural cause. He gonna die because yeah. he was old. But it's forty years, yeah, he gonna be like yeah. eight, 80 years old. You know, it's... and. They was yeah. making and they made Rebels the times when the sequel trilogies was coming out. They ended it before the sequel trilogy ended. Right? And the yeah. only one who didn't have a force voice at the end, all the people that gave her that, that said something to her. Was I'm all the Jedi. The only person who didn't say nothing that we didn't see was Ezra. Mm-hmm. Kanan said something. Ahsoka said something. Right? Soka had a voice in there. Ezra didn't. Luke, all, you know, when you get Obi, all, everybody who we, Anakin, all of them. Ezra didn't. Ezra the only one that didn't have a voice. I'm telling you. Ezra the most important person in the damn Star Wars universe. Most important person, man. Because you think about it just from a a thing, because if he he in the, the, like you say, the the, the level of what he's been doing, he literally can, if he, bro, would you be like, man, that's some bullshit? You, I mean, you could say it's some bullshit, but in theory, Ezra could come back, meet with Luke, and be like, "I got to tell you something. You about to make a mistake in a minute. Don't do that." Oh! You know what I'm like, he could do that. Can you imagine that, bro? <laughs> he he could do that. You want to talk about my bro? You want to talk about? He could tears? do that. You want to see tears, bro? If bro, if he do that. That that line, if he say something like that, if he say, it's about 
he gave him the he gave him the back to the future, like, hey Marty, it's about your kids. <laughs> nah. <laughs> where, where he like, no, nah, no. Nah. Where he like, you about to make you gonna make a mistake. And he like, he like, I see, I know you're building that temple. But you're, you're making the biggest mistake of your life. Whatever. He can he walk dropped, him in there. Bro, he, he can walk him in there because he can find another temple where he can find bro, that gateway in there. He used how, Sabine, him and Sabine figured it out. Oh my god, bro. You know how big that would be, bro. That would change the little that the history of Star Wars, bro. Going like that would shift Star Wars. We do that, bro. We talking about new movies, yeah. new television shows. We talk if we ch- if you just do that, if you just shift the future like that in that way, man, bro. Man, I, bro, I'm shedding tears, bro. If I see that, bro, you yeah, tell me that to he, he gonna years in the first- yeah, if he gonna stop him from. Doing that shit with killing it, about to kill his nephew and getting all them people in the temple killed and failing all that. Bro. He pulled Ahsoka, man. He pulled Ahsoka. Precedent Ahsoka, is set. She was supposed to die. She's about to get dog walked. When you see him when he pulling her, because she was fighting with him, and then when he pulled her, it was over. When he pulled her, she was about to die. Yo, she came through. She was about to die. Oh. And they crash, and, and she like, yeah, bro. So like, and then all that, and he can hear, and he heard all the, and even with that one, he heard all the different Jedi voices, but he hadn't heard Luke. Now, Luke Luke wouldn't, obviously, because they would have been, I, I get why he didn't hear Luke out there, because Luke was still the farm boy trying to trying to get the Tashi station. But, but when you, when you, but you could figure like, I, I, to, to get that quest to get back there, that he just need to go find, go go close to where the mortis, you know, where the father, son, try to get close to where that time and space, because that was a time and space planted area. Because remember when Anakin and all them was in there? Anakin saw his future, and he saw that he was going to become Vader, and Ahsoka died, but then, you know, they, they put the, the she brought the, the force, she put her life essence in Ahsoka. But when they came back, Rex was like, y'all only, we, y'all was gone for like a half a second, like we just yeah. missed you on the radio real yeah, quick. Yeah, it right. was only a second for them. Well, they was gone for like you know what I'm saying, bro. weeks. This is what so I'm saying. He could, he, he, his, his force could get him back to. Well, we, I don't want to write. No, I'm not gonna write. I'm just saying. Like, I, if it happened, we get, man, we get, we we get fan sit, fiction here, but it's, it, we I, wouldn't I hate sit you. here and be like, "What? Oh. That don't even. That makes more sense than Luke being a coward and hiding on the on the planet. You get what I'm saying? Like when you start talking about you're gonna do a story because it's already set up. <laughs> that was never set up that Luke was gonna be a coward. But you can we salvage this. this. Look, I don't know if Disney ever gonna see this. Disney, you can salvage this. Yeah, you can save this. I don't know if Dave did this from the beginning. It's like a fit, like a what they say, call it fail safe or, or yeah, like a a reset button. Pretty game. We saw them, we saw them per gills, bro. That might. I'm telling you, it was you, bro, real. We gonna look back real. on this and be like, we are gonna be like, oh, you about to if I could throw my glasses and not break them, <laughs> right, I, right, because bro. that makes bro. it that makes it real. That makes it real, bro. That makes it that 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 makes it. Real. Ezra is alive. He's coming back. He's out. He's somewhere outside of like time and, and space. Like, call it what it is. That's where he was. It, it, that's what I'm saying. So space. it's like, so it's like, bro. Like you said, president has been set. He pulled her out out of her certain death. Yes. Pulled her out. His younger self had got pushed back, right? That was before she pushed his younger self back and proceeded to fight and she was about to be done. But his yeah, yeah. older, yeah. older Ezra, bro. Older Ezra can see the other side of it. Older Ezra can see, like, oh, yeah, that I remember this. Ezra getting pushed out the thing and then Ahsoka older. in there scrapping, but it was over. That's what I'm saying. She's about to be done with it. So he changed the future. He could do it again. He <laughs> altered events. He created paradoxes. We know how time travel works in, in movies. <laughs> so it's yeah. like, and you don't listen. That that sequel trilogy, it, that happens. It happens. Uh this would obviously be a paradox, but. Like I, I take it back to what you just said. It's, it's starting to become very real. It's Once start, we saw it's, the purpose, it's, it's, it was real. It's very real. It's, it's starting real. to become a possibility where you like, man. Hey, I'm telling you, bro. If they do that, that's a you big bring moment, Ezra bro. back. If you bring Ezra back, that's a you bring all moment. that back. 
<sighs> you don't That's erase you you can't erase the um the the world between worlds like I think that's supposed to be a thing a part uh, of a Soka show that's, anyway and that's gonna because be a Thrawn yes. got some stuff off for that they right? already said it they already said it it's it's yeah. they already they already cast different versions of Ahsoka they a younger because she sees her younger self at some point fighting <laughs> like she see I think she sees snips they, in the show you know they you know that yeah yeah because they got seen they cast you know they said that they recreated you ever seen the end of rebels where she show up but Sabine was like, it was like five, it was like after uh, Return of the Jedi, Othal is driving, is, is thriving, but they was like, uh, we, um, and then she's looking at the, she's looking at the wall, there was a painting on the wall, you know, she did the paintings and stuff, it was painting on the wall of all them, Kanan, um, 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 uh, the, the whole team, the ghost team, right, the, what they, Phoenix, Phoenix Squadron, right, it was all them, and she looking, she was like, I kept thinking about what, oh, yeah. what oh. Ezra said, yeah, they said they did the live that. action, recreated that in live action. I'm chilling up right now because, like, that's a dope little scene, right? Yeah, and it's is, like man. they say they showed that at the last celebration. That's so they recreated that scene in live action Shout about them to trying Rebels, to go find man. Ezra. Shout out to Rebels, bro. Yeah, Rebels they recreated might, that. Rebels might be what saved us, bro. <laughs> Rebels, Rebels yeah. might be what saved Star Wars, yeah. bro. We talking about some some meta stuff now, bro. We talking about the yeah. meta now. Because we all know Star Wars is in a state of like it's kind of broken right now, right? And that's not even mm -hmm. me hating. That's not even me hating. You can no, like the sequel. It's fact. Whether, whether you like the sequel trilogy or not, you know what I mean. And and, and hey, sequel trilogy, it ain't it wasn't my favorite, but some people liked it. You know what I mean? And mm -hmm. I get that. Yeah. I get that. But they kind of wrote themselves into a, a you know an and into a corner, like they kind of yeah, like box themselves in. Yeah, you know how they say uh, you screw the pooch. The <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Like really they kind of they, they they it made it so bad that it's like they can't continue on from this point. This could be your way to get out of this without completely disregarding that timeline, but yeah. just to say like that's just to show Luke like, hey, listen, Luke, that was a possibility for you. I'm going to stop you from making this mistake, but you were about to make this is the huge this is the mistake you make. This is how it turns out for you. This is how you die. You lose your nephew. Here's a different path. And this is and, and just think about is, it, bro. Think about it from a think about it from like a, a, a regular people standpoint, right? Luke only, and this is not the throw shade in the, the, the Jedi order, right? We all I always do it. But Luke, <laughs> even from a even from a council standpoint, was only talking to Obi Wan and, and Yoda. They fucked up. Yeah, they did. So in terms of like guidance and all that. Oh yeah. Oh, like yeah. like like Ezra lived a real life. You know, attachment and all that shit. I ain't gonna get into like you shouldn't have attachment. You know, that's an order. That's part of the thing. That's part of the thing. But Ezra lived in a real world, a real life. Like I say, he was doing military operations. Right. He was doing this. He was like. He was like. He was like Anakin without the dark side almost. You get what I'm saying? Like in terms of the level of Facts. different experiences he had in life. Facts. Right? Facts. Like Ezra got all that. Like he's not Anakin. Oh, I'm not comparing them to No, 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 like, no. I get what you makes saying, him no. different from the other people. He just wasn't somebody they picked up. He didn't have he a trauma that Anakin had, right? He didn't, he didn't. No, he no, didn't none have, of that. He didn't have a trauma. No. Yet. Yeah. But losing his losing his mom and that, you know. Yeah. But he had lived a life, like meaning like he was. He was just humping her. He wasn't sitting around when he was four. And somebody noticed he had the force, and they came took him from his mom's, or like those little, like a little baby or something. Like he had lived hopping around. They jumping around. They hijacking stuff. They doing different things. They was on adventures. I say all that to say, I say all that to say, like um, like Luke wouldn't even have nobody else to like, like, like the shit that could lead him wrong is the shit that was like. He was hearing from like Yoda and Obi. You get what I'm saying? Like not, not no real world guidance that he could have got. I'm not saying Luke didn't live a real life, but I'm saying once he became part of the force, like once Ezra knew he had the force, man, not only did he have Kane and we named all the people, but he also had Zeb. He also had Sabine. He also had, he met, he met Bo-Katan, you know, he, he fucked around, was getting, getting, getting played by Yondu, Yondu you know what I'm saying? Not Yondu. Uh, nah. <laughs> Bindu. Hondo. Oh no, Hondo, Hondo, Hondo. Yeah, yeah. he's seen the Bindu. You giving up like all different kind of things. He came across Thrawn. Shout like, out to the Bindu. <laughs> shout out to the Bindu. Uh, he was on the different ships. He, they done, they done snuck in the Imperial facilities to get 
um, get people out and go back in and do all these different things. You get what I'm saying? So he had like a real world experience. And then you got a guy who actually um, was one with the force when it came to like the, you know, the, the cosmic and then the, like they could, they could, they can talk where it ain't just like, okay, I'm listening to these guys. Yoda telling me to do a different way. Yoda telling me I should do this whenever I need force guys. Obi saying this, but all of them was, even when they got older, was still a certain level of wrong. In my opinion, you get what I'm saying? Like they they was getting him right, but like, like you gotta kill Vader, you gotta do this, you gotta like y'all was about to lead him back to the dark side. Y'all Thank was gonna you. lead him to the dark side. Thank you. Absolutely right. If he I, just listened, so they, they made the same mistakes. Point. They couldn't write they again. Couldn't, they couldn't think any other way. They didn't know any other way. All they knew was all right. Fail with Anakin. We got Anakin's son. Now we're going to train Anakin. Anakin go, or, uh, Anakin's son is going to destroy Anakin. They didn't know how to think outside of that 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 pra- uh, pragmatic view of yes. Jedi. That's uh, a better way. I, that was a long-winded way of me saying, and Ezra yeah. won't have that kind of view. Because nah. he don't have a pragmatic view of the Jedi. Nah, he was trained I mean, by... You know, or, or, or let's just call it a force. He don't even have a yeah. pragmatic view of the force. Right, so when they talk and they get all this shit, he can like actually, so that when he have that moment, let's say that moment, like this is why, like, listen to what I'm saying. Like I'm talking, I'm talking to you, young, because at some point in time, and you know, 15, 20 years, you're gonna see, you're gonna think your, your nephew got this, and then you're gonna try to, you're gonna pull out the saber, and it's all gonna go go wrong after that. That's you not the way. It. Look, man, like I, we you know, just kind of, you gonna lose yeah. every, you gonna lose everything to the point where. I'll get mad again when you ain't even really ever seen your sister again. You forced Bro. synced her. Oh! Oh! You can redeem Carrie Fit. I mean, uh, Leia's character. Listen. Bro, you just listen. I'm going to end. Luke fucked end. that up. Luke fucked up. We're going to end it. We're we we about to uh, get off here in a minute, but. Hey, but that was, a, that was a poll. That was a statement you made, man, that he the most important person in Star Wars. I actually, I don't think that's hyperbole. Listen. I think that's for real. Listen, your boy, they was in an interview the other day, Dave Filoni and John. They let it slip, extended universe. Now, it's called the expanded universe, but some people call it the extended universe. But they mentioned that. the Listen, man, these two guys are very aware of this, of the, of, of the original EU. Yeah. In the original EU. Who is the villain, bro? Who's the first villain? Thrawn. Thrawn, right? Hey, yo, bro. If you if y'all pull this off with Ezra, y'all can basically do the Th- the Thrawn trilogy, which is like known as like one of the greatest trilogies in the EU. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all can pull up, y'all can pull off the Thrawn trilogy with a new timeline, bro. Yeah. Where Luke, if, if you want to do the Luke show, it's got to be like the Thrawn trilogy. You could do it all off of what we just off the, off of what we just came up with. Like that's that's got to be the the culmination of that is him telling Luke that what you just said, which would make perfect sense. Like, look, bro, it all go downhill from here, man. You lose everything. You lose your sister. You lose your nephew. You lose Jedi. Everything you trained. Everything you built. You lose it. With Thrawn, because remember, Thrawn got to come back with Ezra, bro. Thrawn hey, got to come back. Thrawn got to come back with Ezra, and you can't son Thrawn. Back. You can't you son can't. him. You can't. He you did. can't son Thrawn and be like, "Oh, it's the new order now." No, no. If Thrawn come back, my bad, getting loud. But if Thrawn come back, Thrawn, no, Thrawn got to be like the new emperor. The new Palpatine, yeah. the new Vader, yeah. all in one. Yeah. He the he the supreme commander. Like he's the guy. He the last of like the best of that remnant. Right? He was right? the, uh, the best. He the best. The best. The they best. lost so, the best. So if he come back, he gotta be the guy. And he was the best then, even he in the, the Rebel show. Like he figured everything out. The traitor. And, and, and one last thing, Manny, they don't have to do any kind of like make my bad. Go ahead. My bad. You was about to say something. No, nah, no, nah, no. Nah. I was with you. I was just saying. No, I'm just saying the point I'm making is he got to be the guy. You can't, you can't, yeah. 
we going you with Thrawn. Yeah, you can't say, oh no, it's the beginning of the new order. No, Thrawn got to be once Thrawn. We saw the Perk Hills, bro. Thrawn coming back. If Thrawn come <laughs> back, Hills, Thrawn is the guy, play. bro. Because Thrawn he cannot the be guy. the leader. He will look at the first order and like, man, that's some bullshit. That's some like, bullshit. it's really that's some never, bullshit. It's just a messed worked. up situation. Um, like, 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 it's a messed up. It's a, the time is was easy for them. Like one thing, the last thing about Ezra that I wanted to wanted to kind of say, in, in terms with the with the with the Thrawn and all that, and with the, just about Ezra and Ezra probably will be at a point. But you know, it's probably a lot of things Thrawn saw too, right? But Ezra would probably be at a point where it was like he don't even like he probably in touch with that internally, almost like and like Anakin had. Remember they were saying like his Jedi reflex, he could see things before they happen, right? That's why he can win the power races, the power race, and that's why he had those visions, you know, whether it was Palpatine. But at the end of the day, like like he he had like premonitions that was like real. He could sense his mom was in trouble. Man, Ezra might have without having to even reach into the world between worlds anymore without having to go find a Jedi temple. He probably got that in him. He won with the force when it come to that. He was like, nah, man, you go, a hey, hey, Luke, listen to me, man. Oh, listen man. to me. Listen to me. Leia, or don't don't mess up. Like, we we had a strong rebellion. Like, what Leia thought it was a new republic. But I'm trying to told y'all, we, what we had to go through to get the, don't, don't demilitarize. You had to keep your military. Like, stay, like, like, don't do that stupid shit so, the, so this, this such stuff can come. And this could be, and it could be, it could be not him having to go walk in and look in the portals and see everybody. Cause then they probably get, then you, just, then you start like, Getting way too far, right? Yeah, but it could yeah. be internalized within him that he That's got a that great point. because he was That's already in touch with that. Oh man, ah, he got that in him, so he'd be like, "I'm trying to tell, him. like, I, I down there, like the few, because Yoda could kind of do it. When the only thing he couldn't see is through the dark side of the force. The future is cloudy with you, like that should have been your sign, but like, 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 Ezra might got that, man." This is it, bro. I'm telling. You, I'm just saying, bro. Once we, once that, once oh, yeah, that line come out, turn into that dude. Yeah, we talk. Hey, we talked about it through text, though, man. It's, I tell you, dude is like a nexus being, bro. He's like, yeah, he's something different, bro. We ain't never seen nothing like Ezra, bro. We ain't never seen no. nothing like Ezra. No. I'm talking about <laughs> an expanded universe and in, in the new canon, whatever you want to call it. We ain't never on the Sith side, the Jedi side. We ain't never seen nothing. Like, we ain't never seen nothing. We never seen somebody never get seen. all these jewels and end up in the places that they end up and see the things that they seen and understand what they seeing. Again, Palpatine was in the world between worlds, right? But he, he didn't he didn't understand it to the point where he can use it to his advantage. He needed Ezra for some of them things, right? Like like some of the things he couldn't do. Like you hear. Remember, he tried to even entice him with his parents. Like, it was, like, at the emperor, that dude. But he needed, yeah. like, I just need yeah. you to, hey, look, we need to join forces because you could do some things I can't do. That's what I'm saying, bro. We ain't never seen nothing like this kid, man. Ezra, hey, Ezra Brill. I keep saying Miller. <laughs> Bridger. Did it Ezra Brill. <laughs> yeah, Ezra Bridger, bro. Nice just, just off the pergule. And that's, and that's where I, I, I wasn't this deep because this is way better than what I was thinking. But it was just like you see the Pergill in the Mando episode was like, yo, don't don't let that be just that because Please don't. that Please means don't. so much more for anybody that 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 watched anybody that has watched all the stuff. If you watched everything, Star Wars is Star Wars. Like you watched everything, that means a lot, man. And when you break down to what Ezra could be now, what he and should it be now. We were it joking a, at first, but it got real, right? Like, hey man, ain't nobody had no jewels, like to the point where you was like, Hey man, even Obi knew he wasn't really hey man, you ain't really hey, supposed man. to be in this timeline. <laughs> Obi <laughs> almost so spoke out of like Obi almost <laughs> broke the fourth wall. Like, you're not supposed to be here. <laughs> like, bro, you fucking up the movie, is what I'm saying, bro. Listen, <laughs> you fucking up the trilogy. You don't <laughs> you're not supposed to be here. You too, you OP, bro. Get out of here with you. I'm supposed yeah, to I'm run really, with you right now. You make it, you're making my mission obsolete. <laughs> you're not supposed to be here. Told the told the told the board of Mosey on, bro. Like, hey man, Mosey on, little niggas. Ain't that ain't that what uh get about that, here. What, uh, we about to ain't that what we about to go, but ain't that what uh like like uh Thor Mama did in or in game? Like, you're yes. not the, you're not the it was like that. You ain't really supposed to be here, you gotta oh. go back. Obi felt that, bro. Obi felt that. Obi was so keyed in on his mission, though. Obi knew though. 
you ain't supposed to be here. <laughs> you can't help me right now because yeah. you ain't you ain't even supposed to be here. So it's not like I'm gonna recruit you to save the galaxy. Nah, man, I'm on a mission. I'm protecting the chosen one. You though, you something else. You're not supposed to be here. Yeah, I don't got a title for you because we already titled my man the chosen one. Yeah, but <laughs> you special though. You you on some Neo the Matrix shit. You know what I mean? Like and like I, I like. Like I imagine, in, 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 in his in his force, I imagine Obi Wan just like looking through the force, cause you know how you got your regular vision and you got like you see shit through the force, bro. Ezra Ezra Aura Ezra Aura probably was like great, like wow, bro. He probably looking at his aura like, oh hell no, you ain't supposed to be. He ain't even really look at it. He playing with the fire, like you got the. <laughs> You're not supposed to be here. Right. Ezra Bridger. Yeah, he was hoodied up. And- yeah. <laughs> Ezra Bridger. Just, just put, throwing a, running a stick through the fire like, like Bro, are you knew. cooking something else? He and knew he was he get about here. He knew like if he was sitting there any more longer, man, Vader, the Emperor, anybody that was anything in the Empire would have had it like, now nah, we all know that aura. Oh, they would have felt guy, it. something else. Of, all this. I sense a disturbance. Send something in the force, man. Next thing you know, Vader on Tatooine, man, figuring out why he's feeling three different force auras and shit. <laughs> Obi Wan, <laughs> something else. <laughs> I wanted Obi, but <laughs> that over there, though. Yeah, like, bro, like you said, you called him a walking disturbance in the force. He is, bro. He a problem. He's an anomaly. Ezra Bridger, bro. Hey man, Obi spoke out of like care, like he he spoke meta, like you ain't supposed to be here. You ain't, a, you ain't a part of this story. Like, you no, know, this ain't you, this ain't for you. You actually could. You you gonna you gonna make the season finale unbelievable for yourself. <laughs> like, like right. especially as nice as he was at the end of the end of the run. Like, yeah. And and what he and, and the in, as in tune as he was after Kanan died, as in tune as he was, um, um, going into like you say, man, like, like then you see those pergil because he was in tune with the. So when he saw those pergil, was when you see that he's like, man, listen, man, listen, don't play me, man. I don't even gotta see him in the show. I don't hey, gotta man. see him. But, but it wasn't a short play me, man. It wasn't a short scene, though, was it? It, was, it, it wasn't, wasn't a like a scene. That was it on like, purpose. Man. It wasn't like it wasn't like a blip, like a like, like a like, like a glimpse. In, like in, it was like, like yeah, it was a full. It was like purposeful. Like they showed us loaf cats. Like probably spoke. scared him. It. Yeah. it was like a, the, the future yeah. of Star Wars. Wait, uh, what'd you say, Ezra? Oh. <laughs> like, <laughs> Ezra, look at this. You see a little that? body on top of one of these. Like Ezra, Ezra. <laughs> a little body. <laughs> Looking like J- Janet Pym in the thing. <laughs> Got a little rope around things like. Cape flying in the back. I need, I need to look, Good man. Oh, man. Oh, look, man. man. We see Ezra on these podcasts. Oh, oh man. You know what I'm saying, man? Like, it's not. Hey. They don't got a showing. But don't, nah, like, man. again, like, we about to go, like, in season one and season two of The Mandalorian, the law, the law, one of those little loft cats showed up. That was a nice little thing, oh, people yeah. that watch Rebels. Yeah, loft yeah. cat. Cool. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. I like that. Pergill? Don't look at it on my top screen. Pergill? It's a totally different thing. Like totally you could, you could, even though he died, you can have a reincarnation of the Bendu. Can we keep talking about him? And it, it'll be like, oh man, that's the Bendu. <laughs> but <laughs> that still ain't covering it like Pergil, man. Because that's the last thing we seen with Ezra. What's the Pergil bro, that's, taking? Him? That's it, bro. That's that's it. I'm <laughs> telling you. I think we urban in the force, bro. Oh man, we can go Ezra, make ourselves off of film, I know, bro. I know. <sighs> But tell you, bro, you gotta. But it it, it, it won't go away. Like it, it, they, it's not. They've done. 
if you keep Ezra around, it can't go away because you just he's you said the president has been set. He yeah. has done this before. He did it. And he could have did it with Kanan if he wanted to. Ahsoka had to talk him out of it. She's uh, like, if he take him, he she took him. He like he's that if y'all y'all gonna get wiped off if you if you pull him out. Because and, and I'm making a prediction early. I'm making a prediction early. They they're setting up their own Thrawn trilogy. Whether that's gonna be what we we get the 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 conceived uh Talked about Mando movie. Thrawn is the Thrawn is the is the is the is the, is the, is the, is the, is the villain. You know they so they they, they setting it, it up a crossover event like a like a crossover yeah. like an Avengers Thrawn the guy, crossover bro. event. Yeah, Thrawn's the guy, and Luke is a big part of that in the expanded in the EU. Luke is a big part of that. So if you want to do yeah. it, man, if you want to do it without making Luke. Lame because we know what Luke is gonna end up being becoming. If you want to do it and not have that ruin it for people, where they know, like, well, that don't matter how much ass he kicking because we know what he gonna end up doing. If you want to, if you want to, if you want to erase that out of people's minds, if you want to, like you say, palate cleanse. If you want to just yeah. give people hope to where it's like, well, shit, I don't oh, know what's gonna happen. I don't, I don't know what's gonna happen. This is the, this is the key, man. This is the key. And then, and then, like, then you can leave the keys to a certain group of people to carry on right like everybody get their proper type of send off because we didn't get that but 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 even just beyond the beginning before like before i go downstream just the fact that you can have a situation like that mando luke you know i'm, I'm not naming people in order of appearance order importance or like that crossover event sabine Ram. rando oh, I, man, wasn't the- even, I wasn't even going there i was gonna go mando ahsoka luke ezra Little Grogu, right? Who's supposed to be in a thing? That's just right there. But then we go Boba, Sabine, Bo, like whatever side these people are on. But like, and then Thrawn, because right. Thrawn needed all, all look, just in Rebels, they needed all that for Thrawn, right? Right. They didn't That's need, what I'm saying. Uh, <laughs> That's what I'm saying. All that for Thrawn. So he gonna he gonna come. But we still got the remnants ah! of the empire. Like say, we're not first order. This is the oh remnants of the God. empire. So they we, needed so... all that for Thrawn, and they needed Pergil to beat him. You so know what I'm saying? Ba- we're gonna basically get that again with a united Mandalore. That's, man, that's and they bring in what's the name? Because she gonna be in the Soka, the um, the the, the pilot. Of the um, what can I remember her name? I like her. The leader, the the uh, Sindula. Yeah, so uh, around yeah, she alive. Son, yeah, yeah, yeah. Around oh. to have her son, Jason. So it's like, oh. so like, I'm just saying, like, and they, but they needed all them to see Thrawn. They had two Force users. Yeah. They had, yeah. they had two Force users, Mandalorians, and all that. And Thrawn was still really, he was really smacking them around. So you gonna need Luke, but it's setting up for that, ain't it, man? It's setting up like, for that, ain't it? What did we like, say earlier? Usually, the 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 the, the easiest what was the line we used earlier about the response. Like, usually the most obvious, the most, likely out, is, the most obvious likely usually out. one is gonna go mm-hmm. right so. now. Whether we get a reset, swell up in the air, but we get that up in the air. That's up in the air. We we, we are. Gotta have we that. are getting you a united. Gotta have that though, man. Yeah. You gotta have we, that. We get we get a united him, front against. Uh, can't uh, have him not drop a jewel to Luke like. <laughs> and he make a decision later, like I gotta have. I'm not. I can't use. I'm actually talking. Hell, just in this period of being able to talk to talk to, um, because we didn't know that was happening until now. We now we have it. We saw it in the book of Boba Fett. Him talking to like like Ahsoka, but I don't think I, don't, I didn't like. Cause she she seen what happened with 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 uh with, with with Anakin, right? Once she figured out it was Anakin, right? But then she <laughs> she kind of fell back into the attachment kind of. Kind of talk so she could be like, because I was like, maybe he can get Ezra back. He could get that little noise out of it. Like, yo, that's I'm trying to told y'all, man. Ain't nothing wrong with having family. There ain't nothing wrong with this. I'm telling you, he, he you already pay more it. attention. You pay more attention to Ben Solo about the from the family side. You won't be pulling out a lifesaver on this dark. And he may go to the dark side, but you're not going to turn into a coward because of it. You got that Skywalker blood. Like, oh man, anything's possible. Uh, Right. I hope, bro. I you, hope you know the story about Darth Plague is the wise. What if he did that shit? I know. <laughs> like, <laughs> I know. 
it's unnatural. <laughs> like, it's, <laughs> yeah. it's not hey. a story that the child <laughs> tell you. He said. So, like, this is my point. Like, yeah, so you could get, you can have them, like, when they all, oh, and Ezra would actually bring something to the table in that, man. Just, God, oh, I saw, I, I hope that happened, man. Bro, we, you're right, man. We probably hyping ourselves up for, for Look, ultimate just, failure, you but you can't bring, but it's, it's, you it's there, though, bro. Around with Luke yeah. Live. Can't, can't do that. Ezra. You almost got to, if you can, if you, you got to, this is the thing, man. You got to kill Ezra before he meet Luke then. And that's some bullshit. That's what it comes down. Yeah. And if you, you gotta kill him, if he meet him, if you if you if he meet Luke, if he meet Luke, and the strongest both of them, like Luke the strongest. I'm not gonna debate, I'm not Dave, gonna say he's strong, Dave ain't but he got a him, different bro. kind of force. Dave ain't killing uh, Ezra. He ain't gonna bring Ezra back just to kill him. Just to he's kill just, him like that. So no then way. we gotta have no that way. conversation, like, hey man, look, we can do that. We just gotta us us two, we can put that together where it ain't corny, where it's like, you know what I'm saying? It ain't some corny shit at the end. It's like, no, nah, this is a real thing that happened. We just changing the course. I mean, back, everybody got different rules with time travel, right? Right. And we saw back to the, you know, end game versus this versus that. Back to the future just did, and he just changed the future, right? Like, it's a reset button. Minute, yeah. One minute go back. Yeah. Just, Whereas in game you was, you can't change, you can't change the, uh, you can't change your future. You only can, uh, Endgame was your basically past like your, your past becomes your future. Yeah, you mess around. I had them. Basically, you could you that. can't you can't change the future. You only can create a new. Uh, you can't even change the future. You just it's it's just like a paradox. So yeah, I feel like they did change the future in Star Wars though. Soko was supposed to die. He Soko saved her from die. dying. Soko was supposed to be gone. She wasn't supposed to be a part of. I'm telling you, this shit is meta when you start thinking about it. Because you're like, well, well, why wasn't Ahsoka around during the uh, original trilogy? Was it because she was supposed to die? This I, I, I don't know. I'm just, I'm just saying. That's what I hope they don't do, Manny. I hope they don't spend two episodes in The Mandalorian trying to tell us why. why Because they got to explain that shit, right? Why Ahsoka was not in. How do you do that? How do you, unless you go into the, she going to the world between worlds. And then she see a younger version of herself, and then she see like what she mm. was doing, like what she in between that. We get to go back in time and see why she wasn't in the trilogy, right? Yeah. Because she was doing this. No, don't do it. Don't do a Boba. Don't do a Mandalorian. Set up a couple episodes. He was on Soka's. You know, I just I'm just throwing it out there. But no, I'm but you. you have to explain that. But yeah, like that would that. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Ezra just turned into the most important person. All per gift. And I'm actually. I actually don't feel like that's how verbally us even taking that leap in this portion of the conversation because it makes sense. Man, title the video of that shit, bro. Because I, I, I ain't seen that title out there yet. Man, that motherfucker is the most important in the future of Star Wars. Oh, man. Big homie, man. It's so much shit, bro. <laughs> like, that I'm hoping he can change, but I, I'm, I don't think he is, but it's still, it's like, bro. Hey, it, it the you just I don't know, man. I don't know, but I'm, I'm like it you. happened, but not had happened. Like it happened, but then when he when they meet up, that's not gonna happen. And then we gonna have a, hey, hey, it, remember in the expanded universe, Luke's son is named Ben. Luke's son is named Ben Skywalker, and Leia had and uh Han they have twins, they have twins. Man, what if he? I mean, you know, what I mean, like, who? How much? We don't know. Again, he probably they probably gonna have a son. They probably gonna have a son. They probably gonna have a son. But I'm just saying, like, you just never but know. You get, your your version of time travel said DC has a different one. Like I say in the TV show, they did they did a uh, uh, Flashpoint. Diggle had a Diggle had a son. Before, he had a daughter before. Barry wanted to see his mom alive again. He ended up coming back. Diggle had a daughter. The one older dude that would they join a firestorm. He all of a sudden he had a grown ass daughter. Where does she come from? They set their own rules, right? Whatever your rules are, you settle and we go with it, right? But we already touched upon it. Precedent is set, man. It's not, it's not a reach to think that something it, and, and bruh, it don't have to be Ezra to do it. It could be Ahsoka because they say she going in there. 
what what the hell she got to do? She could go in there. She's not going to go back and like stop Anakin from doing shit, but she can go in and probably like, Luke, you're not going to fall into the same thing as your brother. We got a relationship. What? What? Because she going there. Bro, what, what biggest redemption for her? Oh, What's man. I know would what it be to, to say. Would it be to save her, her master's son from this disastrous ass decision he gonna make? Come on, man. What big? What? Come on, bro. Hey, hey. And Ahsoka oh might. God, hey, man. Ahsoka might. Ahsoka, about might some... Ahsoka might be done after that, bro. Ahsoka might be done. Ahsoka. She might be one she and done. Lose the she, life force. She might the something yeah, the one that she got. She might, the more that might be the that might be her last thing that she do. Her gift to Luke is to say, "Don't do this. Don't fall down it's this a, this path." It's a gift to Luke, but like probably like a really a gift to Anakin. Here's my right? gift. Like I'm gonna save your son. You want to talk about now? I'll you know we talk you know grown men talk about tears and stuff. You want to talk about a moment where it's like <laughs> you gotta just you gotta let one go. Bro. If that happened, because that that actually means more. Shout out to Ezra being the most important person in Star Wars, but her doing that and her with her storyline with Anakin, right? She done built a relationship with Luke, right? But what she means to Anakin, right? And then doing that with Luke because she's the leaks, the sneaky leaks is she's going in there. The more I already gave her the life force, that's why she alive. That's why she got the that's why she got the owl and everything, like. It's some way, some sort of version of that is what she can do in terms of like saving, saving the future of the Skywalker or, or Skywalker, the Force, whatever you want to look in that. But like, no, we're not going to Jedi. This is how we there's, save the Jedi. I'm no Jedi, but I'm gonna save the Jedi. There's no way. You and there's Ezra. no there's no way that there's a scenario where I think she sees what happens and doesn't change it. Because what I would think, she go in there for, bro? Yeah, why would she? To pull Ezra from going to the Pergils and don't. Hey, go bro, I don't want to. Hey, man, everything you get what I'm saying. That's man, the I only outcome. I hope we not setting ourselves up here, bro. But this is wild, bro. They gotta do. But we'll see. That makes sense, it's, man. It's, it's a long that way makes to sense go. For a story. That shit makes and sense. Hell yeah, can walk off into the sunset. I think that's what else. What else would she come back for? She gonna find Ezra. Pergils, we seen him. He coming back. Yeah, he he gonna find himself. He gonna find him. Yeah, her mission gonna be complete. But now she's we know we know we know this for a fact. She's very much in tune and in, in, uh, in, in contact with Luke. She's they like they like this. Not not that they like this, yeah, but yeah. they they close yeah, enough to talk. R two R two got her on speed dial. R two got her on speed dial. They talking right? They talking. She gonna know his his mission. She gonna know what. And, and 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 for her to see how it's gonna turn out, man. If we see that shit, older Luke pulling the blade out, and then she like, no. And then Mark Hamill that we know show up like, what? Did, what why'd you do that? Look, I gotta stop you from whoop de whoop. Don't do you know what I mean? Like, and then she just and then, or she used that information to be able to like go back and talk to. Hey, bro, but hold on. Even if it doesn't, even if they don't make it, they don't make it certain and they don't make it clear that that changes the sequel trilogy. Mm-hmm. It, just to, just to stop him from doing that would be like, just like a, just like a, you mean like stop him from doing that thing because like they still going. I think they, they yeah, yeah, yeah. They just just, have just to become that. Stop him just from we, we, yeah. Stop him from we, doing that. E- even if, even if they don't. They don't like spell it out for you, like, oh yeah, this changes the sequel trilogy, and his nephew don't turn to the dark side. There's no no, even if they just stop if, if it's just her coming in, like you said, her coming in, double blades, stop him from <laughs> like she hop in and like don't yeah, even like, think about like, this orbit, like like or to the point where her the nephew don't see it. Like he still might turn into the dark side. Snoke was talking to him. He got the Skywalker blood. He probably was gonna turn dark side. Whatever. God, we just know Luke please, don't turn please into a cow. Something about this, bro. Please, but we'll see. We'll see. We only can hope, hey, man. Mason, we only can hope, bro. Hey, what did I say? I said a long time ago. The biggest thing about Star Wars is always you always look for is promise. Yeah. 
hopefully they continue to show promise, man.